You know, they see you, you coming out just like your mother. Don't bring mom into this. Yes, you're just like she. You chased her away, selfish. and now you're trying to chase me away. This is what you want. You never have to go to looking for love elsewhere. You cannot evaluate a family by a temporary situation. Your relationships in your family will fluctuate. The family is what? The oldest institution on earth. That means it's older than the government. Which means the government shouldn't touch it. The family pre-existed the government. As a matter of fact, the family is God's ideal institution. Why? Because here's what God intended. The family is the cure for all social ills. Whether it is psychological, emotional, or spiritual. The family is supposed to heal all of that. The reason why our societies are sick, psychologically, emotionally, spiritually, and physically, is because the family breaks down. As a matter of fact, the solution to all of our national problems is the restoration of the family. My parents were separated when I was young. For most of us, we are in the same boat. But it all depends on what we do, which way we take first. We take the right way, then the wrong way doesn't have to exist. But if we take the wrong way, for most of us, we may not even have a chance to choose the right way or to live the right way. Audio Jungle. And your relationship with your child will go up and down. Some things should sometimes do the best things in sliced bread. Audio Jungle. And then at another stage, that same child will look you in the face and say, I hate you. I hate you and I don't want to live here and I can't wait to get out of the house. You're stupid and I want to go live with my daddy. And daddy ain't sent a check. One of the worst things you can do when it comes to family matters is to make permanent decisions uh, over temporary circumstances. Well, you see Lyman No, you are the Lyman guy. As you call me, you should have the plans. What kind of plan? I know you have some good plans. I guess they come. Anything like what? Like anything. I know we could go somewhere, have a car, you know. Pick it up. Since your father ain't coming home now. Are you sure you're coming back in time? I don't want to get caught up with you. Been through this, we have done this, you understand? Oh, gosh, I know. But well, last time we came so close, eh? Yeah, 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 cut it close. And I see thrill of it. No, 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 no. It's not thrill for you, but when I get in buff, it's not a thrill enough. So um, let's not do that again. Yo, look here. Man, we can chill over here. Will I go inside now? What? No. Respect for me. 
me at all. Dad, you're not giving him a chance. Nice guy, you see? He's a nice guy. No, 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 no. You know what kind of fellow that is? And you have him up in my house? But well, you have to be crazy. Dad, you're overreacting. No, it's not overreacting in this, you know. Who is he? He's a guy, he's my friend. You just don't care about anybody or anything. What it is all he was doing? We Talk were not doing me. anything. All he was doing nothing. We were not doing anything. You see this? I got You need to cool down. Girl, you see you? You coming out just like your mother, you know? Don't bring mom into this. Yes, you're just like she. You selfish, chased her away. Selfish. And now you're trying to chase me away. This is what you want? That's why I have to go for looking for love elsewhere. Looking for love? See me? See this thing? Lord? Hey! Father, this girl ain't easy, eh? This girl now 18 years old, and look how she doing. Eh? I don't, I don't know what to do again, eh? I don't know what to do with this girl, eh? She's getting right up to her now. Since I was 14, my parents were separated, right? And since then, my father, my mother, stopped supporting me in such a way that I decide here what? I had to go to school. Now, I had to find money to go to school. So hence the reason I end up in two boats. I trying to go to school and work at the same time. And that couldn't, couldn't happen, so I had to choose one. So, now... I was a workman since 14, since 14, 15, I work in. You understand? So you have to excuse me when I find my solution because right now is a way you have to survive. So that's my deal. This kind of shipping is that man. Bro, what? There's something I don't know about me and my sister Lisa. Your father home now, I think you should go and talk to him and tell him how you feel before you say you'll be tired. And you have to go and sleep outside. I think you should go and talk to him, Tracy. Are you running me? Yes, I'm Tracy. I'm running you. Talk to later. Go and tell your father how you feel. And be nice, sir. I hope this will girl. Well, talk Let's see. My parents died when I was 16 years. Since then, we have been in foster homes. And then when I see you, I realize that we are in the same boat crying same boat feeling like that 
looking for a piece, looking to fill that empty spot. But you have a choice. Is either you choose to rise up and live and help others through Christ who cares, or you choose to rebel and live on your own terms. So, bro, what it's gonna be? Let her. Firstly, Jed, I'm really sorry that you and Lisa parents died. You understand? I didn't know. I, didn't, I really didn't know. And for me, I want to do something that could prove others wrong, could prove my parents wrong, those who were wrong about me then. You understand? As a man who. I try to pop a good image, you understand? I try to do some good. So, right now, look this girl there who, who are with Tiffany. Give me Tiffany, Tracy, right? Right now, what? Watch. She fell out of tree. I'm not even supposed to be by her. How you how that gonna look? I ain't even know what to do there. Then, I end up in a fight. I mean, there's not me. So, I right, tell me what, what, what I had to do, Chad. What I had to do? Because I, I want to do. Well, bro, man. The only solution I come up to, the only solution I could have turned to, I could have just talked to God. That's the only thing I could have done. So, what's it gonna be? Try it, you have nothing to lose. You have everything to give. What's it gonna be, bro? And what are you saying to God, bro? Well, let me find out. Just close your eyes and repeat these words. And believe it in your heart. You have to believe it in your heart. Dear Father. Dear Father. I choose you. I choose you. I want my life to change. I want my life to change. I believe that you sent your son Jesus. I believe you sent your son Jesus. To die. To die. To take away all the sins on that cross on Calvary. To take away all my sins on the cross. Please. Please. Now come into my life. Come into my life. I accept you as my personal savior. I accept you as my personal savior. Thank you. Thank you. It's simple as that, bro. That's all you have to do. And you just need to go through this process and just keep on building on that building on that and let Jesus be a foundation in this life so you can be there with me then? yes bro anytime the church is, is always open with welcome arms yeah we'll tell you now awesome to do that awesome to Heavenly Father God I just want you to bring her back home Bring her back to me. Heavenly Father, when you see and you know all things, God, we are pleased with you. So help. Dan, Tracy. I'm sorry. I'm sorry too, Tracy. I know that I am not the father that I should have been. I was just a provider. I was not there for you. But I'm sorry. I'll feel your mom. And I'm afraid I'm losing you. You're not going to lose me, Dad. I need you. But promise me one thing. What's that, Tracy? That you will work on your relationship with me. At least you all should be talking to each other. I'll try to. Who's that? Let me go and see who's that, eh? Who's that? Mr. York. Yes. Yeah. Um, my name is Damien, sir. Yes. I am sorry for what happened earlier in the day. Right? I... Sorry for disrespecting your house, sir. And I just want to know, sir, if I could have 
feed the dogs with the daughter. Feed the dogs with my daughter? Yeah, man. If I was you, I will leave my daughter alone and I will get out of my house. So, but so, yeah, you hear what I say? Out of my house. Nice. Tracy, you ain't know you looking for trouble, in But the just shall live by faith. That means that there will come a period in your life, I don't care how much you make or don't make, how well you walk or don't walk, what you drive or don't drive, there will come a time in your life that you will be sustained by what you believe. And if your circumstances yeah. can dictate to you what you believe, and you get to the point that you believe that you can't get up, you will not be able to get up. You shall literally live by faith.
my prayers that parents will take up your responsibilities and my prayers that the youth will respect the elders and those in authority. Stay tuned for a couple of videos and you'll be seeing us around. God bless you. Bye. Problem is way bigger than that. The light. You know that.